Welcome to Living Supernaturally. Welcome to another edition. Thank you for tuning in. Um, this whole week we've been studying about uh, about our spiritual health. What are some things that we can do in order to check if we are doing well spiritually? Just like how we would do um, run some tests to find out if we're doing well physically. So today we're going to look at another test or another check, and that is the thought life check or the thought check. What we see and what we hear influences what we think and imagine. And what we think and what we imagine uh, influences our emotions, our speech, our life, our actions, everything. So the question we need to ask ourselves today is, uh, what am I thinking? What am I meditating on? What am I seeing? What am I listening to? because it's very, very important. Now, here are some other questions that we can ask ourselves, you know, are we depressed? Am I depressed all the time? Am I angry all the time? Am I in a bad mood, irritated and lashing out at others, maybe at work, maybe at, uh, uh, you know, uh, in office? Uh, am I feeling unsettled and restless all the time? And am I having a total lack of peace? You know, these are very important questions uh, that we need to ask ourselves. And the key to that, you know, if, if you answered yes to most of these questions, we need to check, you know, what, what, are, what are my inputs? What am I seeing? What am I hearing? What am I listening to all the time? What is going on in my mind? And what am I imagining? What is my thought life like? Um, you know, if, we, if we've been watching a lot of TV, if we are watching a lot of uh, uh, things on the internet, then we need to ask ourselves, am I looking at content or content that is edifying, that is wholesome? You know, maybe we've been watching something, streaming on Amazon Prime or Netflix. Ask yourself, is this something edifying or is it something that's creating unnecessary fear? Or it is, is it something that's suggesting or inviting me or luring me away from God? away from what he wants best for my life. Uh, Psalm 119 and verse 130 says, The entrance of your word gives light. It gives understanding to the simple. Light dispels darkness. His truth dispels lies. The peace of God dispels fear and confusion. And this is what the word of God can do for us. So um, let's meditate on his word. Let's meditate on his truth. Let's be aware of what we are allowing in, into our thoughts through what we see, through what we hear. Let's pray. Father, we pray that we'll be mindful of what we see, what we hear and what we allow, Lord, into our thoughts so that um, our imaginations and what we dwell on might be pure and holy and edifying. I pray that we'll meditate on your word, meditate on your truth and thereby renewing our mind and transforming our lives. We thank you. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Thank you for tuning in to Living Supernaturally. For more resources to strengthen your spiritual walk, please visit apcwo.org.